Tonight, a new step toward a commuter train in the Kansas City Metro. Brenda Lisa Gonzalez joins us live from Independence, where officials made the announcement this afternoon. She shows us what this could mean for commuters. Brenda Lise. Mark, these railroad tracks could someday lead you to stations in downtown Kansas City and eventually even St. Louis. The Jackson County Executive Mike Sanders announced an exclusive deal today in front of the legislative session at the courthouse here in Independence. The county has the option to purchase two railroad corridors, 19 miles of track currently owned by the Union Pacific Railroad. One's in Raytown and the other one is here in Independence. The county needs $59.9 million to purchase the lines, but Sanders says the plan is to get federal and state funding and not money from taxpayers. If you look at any vibrant community, uh, really in the world, certainly in America, vibrant communities, growing communities have access to rail transit and mass transit. If you look at the top 100 cities in the United States, Kansas City rates 99th in terms of access to mass transit. It's something that makes sense for us as a community. Sanders says that once this is purchased, that these uh, corridors are ready to start laying down tracks immediately. It's just getting the money that may take years. Reporting live in Independence, Randall Gonzalez, 41 Action News.